Hey everybody, Scott Mathers uh, here with another uh, video on one of my uh, little pieces of my collection, I guess you can call it. I got bikes, I got motorhomes, I got Mustangs, I got skateboards, whatever. But uh, I picked this up yesterday. It's a 1965 Cutlass uh, F85 Sports Coupe. It's got the 330 cubic inch uh, Oldsmobile Cutlass Ultra High Compression uh, Motor. 315 horsepower, I believe. Uh, super nice. Got the original bottle for extra windshield wiper fluid. Uh, new battery, power steering. It's got manual brakes. Uh, the chrome is in uh, really good condition. Got a couple uh, yellow headlights coming in for each of the inner inner headlights just to give it a little style. See the uh, 65 plates on there. Let's do a quick walk around here. It's got some newer uh, Cutlass Rally, Oldsmobile Rally rims on it. But uh, they look really nice on there, so I'll probably just leave those for now until I decide if I want to do something different. It's got your vent windows. It's got... Uh, all the windows roll up and down really nice. See the body by Fisher. Interior is super clean. It's got some extra gauges. It's got a newer radio, but it fits in there nice. Dash pad, 96,000 original miles. Back seat's nice. All the lights work, which is cool. Super nice headliner. Vinyl top. It may have been redone at one time, but it looks super nice. It's got a uh, black pinstripe down the side. All the glass is in good shape. Trunk. Nice and solid, still has some of the like original paint in there. Rear bumper is pretty presentable. It's got some uh, slight pitting here and there, but uh, for a 55 year old car, still looks pretty nice. And you can see this side, it's straight as an arrow. We'll let you take a listen here. Hasn't been started yet today. Oh, start right up. All the uh, dash lights work, windshield wipers, lights. Hear how nice it sounds. Got a nice rumble to it. Definitely one that I'm uh, was pretty excited to pick up. Dual exhaust. So I'm just going to put those yellow lights on. i got a couple like little minor things to do. I uh, just went over the engine, made sure everything was uh, nice and clean, and tightened all the uh, oil pan bolts and uh, transmission bolts. Just make sure there's no leaks. Thing runs great. I'll give you another video when we are uh, take it out on the road. Thanks. Thank you.
Bravo 69.